Hey guys, Shai Fury here and welcome to my very first art vlog and today's topic is art school or no and my thoughts about it. So let's get going. Art school or no? My thoughts about that. First of all, the art for this video is one of my personal artworks. For this art in particular, I am using my favorite watercolors, Nevska Politra, Winsor & Newton, some Copic markers, gold acrylic paint for some accents, and for paper I am using my very favorite watercolor paper from Fabriano Gentile. And now to the main topic, art school or no? I have to say that I was in art school and honestly, I have learned a lot there, but also I do not get the things that I know now from there. What can art school give you? Well, I can tell you my experience when I was there and what I think about that. One of the things you can learn from art school is the basics. What do I mean by that? The very basics, how to organize your time when you are having a deadline for a certain art project you have to do for one of your classes. What is perspective? How to apply the objects that you have to draw for your etude on your canvas or paper, depending on the class you are in. What else you can learn? Honestly, a lot, if you pay attention in class and to what the teachers are trying to explain to you. Also, the different types of medias like graphics, watercolors, acrylic, oils, sculpture and art history. And of course, some color theory that is very helpful when you are making a watercolor study. At one point you get sick of doing almost the same etudes. Let me clarify what etude means. It is derived from the French word étudier, meaning study. And back to the main topic. After spending a lot of time making those etudes, you get sick of them. A lot, trust me. One of the things that art school taught me was to get out in the nature and to observe it. Seeing the colors and different shapes and how to apply them on the paper. But let's talk about what you do if you're not in art school. I think it's safe to say that all artists partly begin to rely on being self-taught at one point. Like I said, art school gives you the basics. And then what? What to do? I will tell you what I did. Since I did not get much information about anatomy, in my art school I started to learn it on my own. Reading, drawing, searching for good reference poses helped me a lot to improve my art skills and understand it much more. But that's not all. I started searching for more information about colors, different techniques. For example, mixing watercolors with dry pastels or using acrylic as a base and then applying oils to my canvas and other stuff like that, as well as experimenting on my own with what is suitable for my art style. Also practice a lot. That means making doodles, or just a simple sketch can help you a lot to improve and train your hand and your eye. Perfecting the lines that you are making when you draw and making them cleaner and not strange and very poofy. Also learning from other artists. And let's be very clear about that, not copying them, but trying to make a study from their work further helps. So in conclusion, in my opinion, it is cool to be in art school, but you have to work hard on your own as well. If you want to go to art school, just make sure that is the best suited for the things you want to learn. If you are not in art school and you love to draw and you want to get much more knowledge on your own and if you have the opportunity, search for private classes for particular things you want to learn or improve and never stop practicing. So, thank you all for watching. 
make sure to check out my Patreon page for more content. Make sure to subscribe to see more videos like this and see ya!